Hello everybody, welcome to my new series called Survival Roleplay. Um, I work for a farmer, a very small hay farmer, as you can see. Not much stuff here. His house is up there, and I think he's gonna get some horses at some point, but he just hasn't yet. So, that's what he's making the hay for. So today he's given us a job that we have to mow half of this field, whether we want to go up that way or down that way. And I chose to go up this way. And he said he already had the tractor out, but he didn't, so I had to get it attached. But yeah, we're going to start mowing here now. So, I'm going to try and stay away from those weeds. Oh, and it looks like he has a trailer right there, too. So, we're going to get going. Start mowing. Alright, so I just finished most of the field. Um, it took quite a while, but I still have a little section to go here, uh, as you can see. So, I'll probably just do this one off camera, so I'll be right back. Alright, so I just on the last pass here. 
And then we're almost done. Well, then we have to tat it and windrow it, but... There is the mowing done. Have that lifted up and folded up. I'll head back. And then... I didn't mention this, but we are getting... $750 per day. So... But I have to get the tether out. So I'll have to move the baler. Right there. Alright, so we got that stuff taken off. We're just gonna back the baler up to here for now. Right there. And jump out. Get it attached. Alright. And we'll just move it out of the way for now. And we'll just stick it in here. Like that. Get the engine turned off on that. And we'll run back over here to the IMT tractor. And then I will actually just take that front loader off. He said if that you're not going to use the front loader, just take it off because it'll be a lot better. And it turns sharper then too. Alright. Got everything hooked up there. Get it raised up. Alright. Get that unfolded also. And yeah. Fired it up. So I would eventually like to buy a farm and get a tractor at some point. Obviously, I have my truck, so I can get around, so I don't think it really makes sense to buy a farm until I can buy a farm and a tractor, because that'll, what would be the point then? So I think I'll do that, which means we're going to have to save up for a little while, depending on what tractor we get, actually. So I'm going to get this done, and I'll see you guys in a little bit. Alright, so 
or just on the last two passes or so. So, almost done. And then I'm going to ask him if he wants it wind drilled right away, or if he wants to wait. He does not have the most money either, so. Just get these misfits. Alright. Last pass here. All right, you will turn it off and lift it up and fold it up. We will just stick this in here. We'll run up to the house and see what he wants done. Right, jump the gate again. Alright, so I just got done talking to him and he said he does want it windrowed. And you guys all saw the tiny window or in the shed down here. He said that he just leased a bigger one. So we are going to take the tractor and run and get that. And he also said that this tractor works better on the baler. So we'll put this one on the baler and it's said. And we'll put uh, the Massey Ferguson on the wind drawer. So we'll just uh, drop that there. And head over to the store, which is conveniently not too far away. Right now. He said that he just started this farm and was looking for help. But I have not seen him even do anything yet. But, whatever. That might be on purpose, who knows. But that means more work for us. So, we're gonna get lined up. And this should not take too long. But, I'm gonna get this hooked up to the baler real quick. Alright, so we got it on the baler now. Um, he said he's actually going to come down here and bail right behind the wind drawer. So, I'll leave this here for him and I'll see you right when I jump into the tractor. Alright, so we are starting off now. He said he's going to follow us. So, which I would think he would want to run the wind drawer, but...
actually our last pass, I think. If that all fits in there, at least. <clears throat> Excuse me. Alrighty. There we go. Hopefully he doesn't turn off a bailer. No, he didn't. Alright, we're gonna lift this up, then. And then... Alright. So he's actually almost got a bale in here. So I think we're just gonna go collect all the little bits till I get this bale. And then we'll call it good. Now as you can see, the pickup on this baler is like midget, so. Let me get that steering wheel tip back. Almost there. There's a tiny bit off. Open up the back. Get all that taken off, and then I actually gotta put the front loader back on here so that I can move all those bales. Alright. I wanna put the Spike on. I can't see it. Oh, yeah. Alright. Okay. Leave it alone. Lift it up. Now, is this self leveling? Yes, it is. Alright, it is a self-leveling front loader, so. Now, he did say that he's actually going to sell these bales. And that he is going to give me a map to get there. He said he's going to send it over my phone. And when I did figure out his name, his name is John. But he's asked me to run this back to the the first, so I'll be right back. I'll go do that off camera. Alright, so I just got back, and he wants all those bills sold, and he sent me a map. Let's get that pulled up. Okay. Alright. Here we go. He said it's actually just outside the town. So, this place right here. So, up through the town. Alright, I can do that. Seems fairly simple. So, I'm actually going to use my truck. He said that I should probably use a tractor, but if I wanted to use my truck, I could. So, I'm going to. And it is now 4.10 in the evening. Right, that should be good. Alright. I'm going to sit here and test the lights. 
Alright, all the lights work. So I'm just going to get this pulled in the middle of the field. <coughs> and we'll start loading them up. I think right about here is fine. I'm hopefully going to get them all on the trailer. Otherwise, I'll put some in the bed of the truck if I need to. So, let's see, guys. Actually, I probably won't time lapse this because it shouldn't take me too long. Actually, yeah, I'll time lapse this. for uh this kind of stuff so but it does work so all right you know go up here I'm really far off. There we go. Alright, let's go back. Alright, so I'm just pulling up to his house now. Just to see if there's anything he needs done. Lastly, so... We will run up here and see. Alright. He said that there is not something else, but I just transferred him money, so I'll be right back, and he's going to give me my paycheck. Alright, so as you can see, he has given me, he has paid me, and I actually just bought something for myself. No, it was just a trailer. Just a small trailer.
they just I didn't actually buy it yet, but I, they pulled it out to see so I could look at it. So I'm gonna jump out and look. Looks pretty nice. It's gonna look pretty big for my truck. I think I'm actually gonna go talk to them about a new truck. They said they had either this truck, and if I was to get it, I'd probably put it in a darker color. Or they have uh, this truck, which to me this one looks more like a work truck. So I think I'm actually going to trade my other one in to get this one. So I'll be right back once I'm done talking to them. Alright, as you can see, here's our new truck. And our new trailer. And for the other truck, we actually got a lot of trade-in because it was pretty much brand new still. And this one's actually pretty used. So, in fact, it has over 200,000 miles on it. How does it sound? Pretty nice. I'm going to scoot my seat up. There we go. And back up to our new trailer. Which I'm not lined up with. Alright, there we go. So we're gonna head back to my house now, and then yeah, we'll be calling it a day. And conveniently, my house is right there. So, but I do have to back in. So I'm gonna throw my hazards on. And then back it in. Pull forward. Uh, look around my seat here. I can't really see the trailer. There it is. What was that? There we go. I'm just going to put right there. So now I can use this to transfer whatever I need to. Seeds or whatever. So. I'm on my own. Broken alone. I feel the rain crashing down. All around this empty town. I'm searching for the lost and found. But you don't care. You're unaware. 